Hi, my name is Dan Dolezal. I've been in Coeur d'Alene for just 25 years now. I moved here in 1988 uh, and love it. I think it's a wonderful place to be. I moved here from Libby in Montana. I've got the camera corral downtown in Coeur d'Alene and that was what brought me here, purchasing that business. And it's been a pretty nice going concern, a nice toy store for the last 25 years. Uh, I met my husband about 16 years ago and We've been together ever since then, and life is good. Life is very nice. We've got grandchildren and moving forward. Coeur d'Alene, when I got here, there was a stoplight in Hayden, and the next stoplight wasn't until you got to I-90. Downtown, even though I'd been in Coeur d'Alene, going through Coeur d'Alene my entire life, I never knew where downtown was until I bought a business here. Uh, once I did, I was enthralled. The Tubbs Hill, the lake, the whole area is just magical compared to so many other communities. What other community sits right on a lake? The downtown has changed dramatically. After I'd been here for about five years, they put in new sidewalks and a new street, which was really great. It's been a beautiful place to watch it just blossom. Uh, I'm extremely happy with the city administration and am pretty pissed about the recall. There's not a really active gay community, it's mostly just a bunch of couples, you know, we're just normal people like everybody else, business people, uh, teachers, uh, you know, friends that happen to be in and out of relationships, just as bad as everybody else, uh, and perfectly normal, and just about everybody has kids. That's kind of the amazing thing, is uh, uh, we're, we're not infertile. <laughs> what inspires me? Lately it's been gardening and my grandkids. That's the, I guess that would be the two big things, especially because it's May, it's spring, and we've got wildflowers everywhere. It's just wonderful. I just, oh my god, I love that. Uh, we got a new batch of chicks, so we're about to where we've become fathers again, chicken-wise. Coeur d'Alene is ripe. It just is ripe. It seems like right on the edge of, I don't want it to explode, but it's such a beautiful place and it's such a wonderful place to live. Part of me is very happy that it's moving and growing in those directions. Part of me, of course, wants it to stand still and not move. I want it to be just like it is for the rest of my life and that's not possible. So.